so now if you get D. My name is Pope Fred, and I'm your host. Let's get this party started. Check out this audience. I'm not promising you anything meaningful today, because today I asked our ten contestants to tell me something deep and meaningless. Let's get off to a good start with our first contestant, Adam. I find it really amazing that so many of us came from Europe, um, and yet we no longer have a European accent. European, huh? You better find a toilet. Nice work, Adam. Let's find out how the judges scored that answer. Ooh, fourth place. Not bad. Well, I want to keep it simple by going on to our next two contestants who did exactly that. Mark, Michael, gentlemen, you're up. <sighs> Metered parking. Can I have your beer? So if I put that together, do I get a drunk parking meter? Alright, gentlemen, let's see how you get. That's Michael going into ninth and Mark going into sixth. Let's see what the next contestant has for us. This one has me thinking about food. Hi, David. I want your mac and cheese. Yum. Mac and cheese. Let's see how we did. Ooh, the judges put you in eighth place, David. Better luck next time. Anyone else in the room hearing this? Seriously. This. So when you ask a question like this, sometimes, People make you think. Let's find out what Carlos and Chris had to say on this matter. Uh, the deeper you go, the less disappointed you will be. Whatever there is, there was. Whatever there was, there could be. So make what there is today count, or make it what it should be. Wow. Think, thank, thunk. Those are some pretty interesting answers, gentlemen. But what? Did our judges decide? Ooh, Carlos, third place. Nice work. And then Chris, seventh. Interesting. Interesting. Well, not all of our answers were short. Some of them were a little longer. Check out what Wall and Mikey served up. You know, I was thinking the other day, what would happen if somebody's dead and they receive a text from my phone? Uh, harder, deeper, faster, deep and meaningless. Um, deep and meaningless. Um, yeah, um, everything I said has meaning, so. Yes. Anyone else in the room hearing this? Seriously. This. Get up. Good job, guys. Let's see how you did. Oh, wow, wow, fifth place. And yeah, it might be 10. Yeah, that. Mm, sorry, dude. Next time. So, we now have two remaining contestants, Elise and Nathan. Want to know what's more exciting? Whoever wins the question today, between the two of them, will be our new leader overall. Take it away, Elise. Ooh, deep and meaningless? Sometimes I just look at myself in the mirror and think, I could have been anybody, but it was me. I'm me, and I'm so happy about that. <laughs> oh, deep. <laughs> um, you never really know who you are until you know who are you? Yeah. Mm. Arise, you won today! Congratulations! Let's put it on the board. That was so good. You are so right. Oh my god, you are. Our contestants earn points each day for the answers they give. Arise is getting 15 points for winning today, while 10th place will get just one for showing up. Aris wins today and claims the top of our leaderboard. That's four different leaders in four days. Man, this is getting exciting.
Congratulations, contestants. I couldn't think of that kind of answer myself. Keep watching. New videos every day. Every letter. Every answer. This is Spark.